Hello, Aloft community. Erica Cooley here to walk you through how to update your user profile on Aloft Air Control on both desktop and mobile. First, I will demo how to update your user profile on desktop. So on your desktop computer, you can open up a browser tab and navigate to air.aloft.ai and then you will sign in with your email and password. And once you're logged in, you will see a screen that looks like what's appearing on my screen now. On the far left side bar, you have a few options here. You can hover over the third option down from the aloft icon and it will show manage. Click on manage. And then go down under admin and click users. Then click on your name on the user option and go up and click on this blue pen tool. This will open up the all the information that's associated with your profile. You'll see here you can change your phone number, you can update your certification number if you're part 107, you can update your issue date for your part 107, all here from this user profile update area. And then you can click save and this will save any of those changes that you have made to your user profile and they will now be reflected on both desktop and mobile. Now switching over to the mobile app of Air Control. If you haven't already, you can download uh, the mobile Air Control app on the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store for iOS and Android for free today. And first you'll open up the app and then you'll log in using that same email and password. And once you're logged in, then you will be taken to the home screen where you can see the map and you will click in the upper left hand corner on the white circle with the three gray lines that will open up that side menu bar of the air control app and then you will click on your name so you can see here my name is highlighted in yellow has an arrow next to it and then this will open up your user details from your flight profile. This will reflect the same information that is on the web dashboard. Uh, so you'll see your first and last name here, your email address. You can update your phone number here. You can also go down under your certificate information, which I'll demo here. And you can put in your part 107 certification number here. And then you can come down to the calendar option and select your issue date for your part 107 certification if you have one. If you're a recreational pilot, uh, you do not need to add in this uh, part 107 certification information um, because you'll just be flying under the recreational provision. And then once you have that selected, that date, and our part 107 certification number entered, you can click up in the right hand corner and click save. And now this information has been saved to your user profile on the Air Control mobile app. If you have any questions or additional concerns as you get started using uh, air control. Please don't hesitate to reach out to our support team. We are here for you to answer any questions. You can reach out at support at aloft.ai and we look forward to hearing from you. And as always, fly safe and fly often.